The population is aging and about 30% of adults over 65 years of age living in the community fall every year. Uh, falls in uh, care facilities and hospitals are common events that can cause severe injury and even death. Then, uh, as the proportion of older adults continue to increase globally, the financial costs associated with falls will increase worldwide. Therefore, uh, prevention of falls is an urgent public health challenge. The risk of falling may be predicted from many risk factors. Accidents and environmental uh, reasons are the most common recognized events leading to falls. And most of such falls are associated with one or more known risk factors like reduced muscle strength, gait or balance disorders, uh, confusion, uh, postural hypotension, uh, visual disorders and of course certain medications. What is great though, a large body of research has shown that attention to these risk factors can significantly reduce rates of falling. And the latest evidence highlights that balance, strength, gait and coordination training is very effective in reducing falls. Indeed, exercise alone and various combinations of interventions including exercise, vision assessment and treatment and environmental assessment has been shown to be associated with about 50% lower risk of injuries falls compared with the usual, usual care. The suggested false prevention prescriptions can be found from the international guidelines which are supported by the latest research findings. And let me shortly refer one of the just published research. In this, in this study, uh, uh, in residential AIDS care facilities in Australia, over 80 years adults participated in progressive strength training program using poor intelligent technology plus balance exercises two times per week for 25 weeks and it was followed by a six-month maintenance program performed similarly two times weekly. And the results were amazing. The rate of falls was reduced by 55% in the exercise group compared to the usual care group. And the exercise group also showed an improvement in physical performance without no serious adverse events.